Hello everyone. This is the part six of NEET MDS 2021 question paper series. Now let's start the video. So the first question was about the antibiotic prophylaxis and a patient allergic to penicillin. So for a patient allergic to penicillin, clindamycins are given. The other drugs are cephalexin and clarithromycin. Then moving to the next question. The uh, next question was about the speech defects. So they have asked about the speech defects associated with class 3 malocclusion. So for class 3 malocclusion patients, labiodental speech defect is present. Now moving to the next question. So the next question was about the zones of pulp. So the pulp cavity exhibit four zones uh, as we progress from uh, dentin pulp uh, junction towards the center of the pulp cavity. So the uh, odontoplastic zone is the outermost zone, followed by a cell-free zone. It is also called as zone of V, then cell-rich zone, and the innermost is pulp core. Moving to the next question. In the next question, they have asked about the malocclusion associated with Milwaukee braces. So Milwaukee brace, uh, brace is an orthopedic appliance used for correction of scoliosis. It exerts tremendous force on the mandible and developing occlusion, leading to the retardation of mandibular growth and possible deformities. I hope it's clear. Now moving to the next question. So the next question was about the clinical trials in which they have asked uh, about in which phase of in which phase of clinical trials we test more number of patients that is more than hundred for safety and efficiency of drugs. So it is the phase three in which um, we test the safety and efficacy of drug in more number of patients. Now, the next question was about the myositis ossificans. So myositis ossificans is a condition where the bone tissue forms inside the muscle or other soft tissue after an injury. It tends to develop in young adults and athletes who are more likely to experience traumatic injuries. I hope it's clear. Now moving to the next question. The next question was about the scissor gate. So scissor gate is, an, is a gate abnormality associated with spastic cerebral palsy. So this condition is associated with upper motor neuron lesion. Next question. So the next question was a direct image based question in which uh, uh, an image of uh, irritation fibroma of tongue was given. Moving to the next question. So the next question was about the canned food poisoning. So it is a poisoning caused by toxins produced by Clostridium botulinum bacteria. So the symptoms include difficulty in swallowing or speaking, facial weakness and paralysis. The treatment are uh, antitoxin injections and breathing assistance. Now moving to the next question. So the next question was an image-based question in which they have asked about uh, the GG drills. So GG drills are used for root canal enlargement. Now moving to the next question. So the next question was about the occlusal convergence. So the occlusal convergence are basically given for the primary retention form of the tooth. Now that's all for today's video. So if you find this video helpful, then please press thumbs up. Till then, take care and happy learning. Thank you.